Hey yo everybody, Prod Charles here and in this video we are going to continue our adventures into Franbo. This is actually the full game and yes, I am going to play it from the beginning again. So if you've seen the demo, this might be a little bit familiar to you, but since it's the full game, I do expect there to be some differences. So let's check it out. Ah. A medicine box whoa had a bit of a glitch there but what happened was I picked up a, a medicine box which I believe is the safe from the demo unless it actually became a medicine box empty bottle empty glasses nothing useful in this cupboard yes I am going to go through this game again I'm gonna not try to examine as much in the first few episodes can I examine this my pills are inside I know it's I can't remember the code for this I think eight was haged or something wait it's on the table Okay, we got some band-aids. Those will come in handy later. Okay, eight is H. Use this. Okay, so eight is H. So that means this is seven. No, this is nine. I is nine. D is four. D is five. Yeah, we did it. We got the pills. The pills that Kitty told her would help her in her subconsciousness. Woo! Let's take some. <laughs> Ho ho ho! Get out, creepy creature! Watch your step. Yes, I like this. The nurse, that evil. Did you just hear that voice saying, "Hey, nurse"? And check this out, guys. Whose head is that? Okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> Let's go downstairs. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know. You can't keep it away from her. Can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. Aunt Grace. Aunt Grace wants us with her this whole time. Was that real? Oh dear, Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. The doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Wow, we have a lot of exploring to do. Oh no, Foxy Fox, don't cry. I think she's doing a little bit more than crying. It was not me. It was not, it was not who? Blood, red. Find him, find who? Hate the monster. Yes, the monster, we all hate the monster. Oh goodness, it's the boy. Why are you looking me at, looking at me like that? You terrify me. Phil is playing with his uncle, and the uncle is mad. Mad! Okay, so, the idea behind those those shadow demon things, I, in my opinion, is from, like, what I experienced in the demo. I think they are what's causing the children to go insane. So, this is actually telling us what's happening. The uncle's mad at this kid. Phil is crying. Oh, poor kid. Poor... Don't you see? Don't you see what? Oh, I missed that. Your mummy's not happy. Uncle will die. Oh, so his uncle's dying. That's why... <laughs> Okay, <laughs> to happiness, you can see. Can we go to happiness? Of course it's locked. Oh, there's a box here, under the bed. Uh-oh, a secret box. Shh, let's use it. A key, this will certainly open something. Could it be this door? Still locked. I think the key was actually for the cupboard in this room. Okay, let's use it. Yes, okay, there's something inside. Okay, we got a bobby pin and a family photo. Wait, that's just the pills, right? That's not what the photo really looks like, right? Oh gosh, okay, that's really freaky. Okay, so we got a photo, we got a, body, a bobby pin. What can we do with these things? What did I do last time? What does this kid say? Hello, Phil. Hello. Know any way out? There are many ways out. Yes, but you know that everything is locked. Indeed, but the office is the key. The office? What do you mean? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Him. Behind you. 
all doors are closed, you are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. That's the demon that's chasing us? Is that all in her mind? No, that's all in there. Leave me alone. I hate you. Mummy. Daddy. I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. I wonder if that monster is just her demon. Her demon chasing after her. Oh! On the wall it says watch your step and look what happened to be on the ground. A needle in a ball of yarn. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I combine these. Awesome! Okay, I've got my own special key now, so let's use... Can I take that yarn? Might come in handy later. Nope, can't. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. We got the key. We got the key. That's all that matters. I don't care about anything else. Let's use it on here. Get out of pill mode. Let's talk to this girl. Hello. You see them. You do, right? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. You mean the shadows? Uh-huh. I can't see them, but I know they are there. Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Well, tell me, please. You like to draw? I love to draw. Yes, I love it too, but tell me more about the shadows. Crayon. A crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. Again. Like, she's got like four crayons right on the ground next to her, to her left. I want to find my cat. Draw a cat if you don't have one. I could draw my cat, but I'd rather find him. Your cat's in danger. The shadows took him. I know. Who told you that? The one that follows me. Bye. Let's ask the one that follows her. You should blame yourself. Be quiet. What? He takes away your innocent inner child and devours it. Nobody believes you, although the wounds are bleeding. Wow, she had a tough childhood. Everyone in this hospital had it really hard. Heck, Frambo alone had her parents just chopped in front of her. Well, I guess... They weren't actually chopped in front of her, she witnessed them chopped up, but still it's really sickening and sad for a 10 year old child. Anyway everybody, thank you so much for watching, if you enjoyed this video like, comment and subscribe, if you enjoy content like this, check out the next video for more Frambo and I'll see you next time, see ya!